going, boys. I'll sort of show you this one. Spent a bit of time shining up the original stuff. Yankee's probably not used to seeing a steering wheel on that side. But yeah, it's a leather trimmer. Removable top. Someone's polished up all the arms. Uh, same under the back. They uh, wearing some chrome. Polished up inlet and so forth and so on. This one's got a blown head gasket, so uh, some stage um, some stage I'll be replacing the well, I don't know the guy's talking about putting another engine in it at 383, but we'll see what happens with that. I might have to build that one up too yet, so but yeah, although well, it's a bit grubby, you guys only had it a couple of weeks or something like that. Look at the gasket, but ceramic headers, blah blah blah. Got this little like, extra um, temp gauge there, so I'd say the thing's probably had overheating problems anyway. But yeah. Pretty fat little thing. Yeah. Wing on the back. It's not a bad thing. Anyway. Let's give you a squeeze at that one. Remember I was telling you, this come out of Japan. Uh, you can see that. That looks Japanese to me. There's GM on there though. That's on the inlet manifold. I'll just show you this. I ain't never seen a, uh, an engine number like this one, but this is just a this will back up my suspicions. Where's that engine number? Can you see it there? Let's get a better look at it. That's a switch. Hang on, torch here. One and a couple of them little symbols, whatever the hell they are. That's the engine number. I've never seen one like that before. Not in Australia. It's not an Australian number. But anyway, yeah, certainly got a blown head gasket. You see the fucking shit in there. So the heads are coming off. We'll just see what damage it's got when I got the got the cylinder heads off it. Bit of a tight squeeze, some of that stuff. Anyway, cheers. Okay, so that is a plane of gasket. You can see there. You won't be able to see. You can see it's distorted. Actual firing. Shag. But the interesting thing is, see how much. Look at that. Can you see how much piston ring you can see through that? You can actually see the, the gap right there in the ring. Look. Do about that. Anyway, I'll just pull this down as far as I can and uh, leave it up to him. Have a good one. I'll keep you up to date with what goes on with it. Cheers. Uh, that gone on the other side as well. Right in the middle there. 
Done all I can do to this until I get a get the word from the dude. So yeah, 